So take us through the training, all of that. Yeah. 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 So initially, while Courtney was filling her two weeks at her previous office, we did the online training, which we've talked about before, where you go on, you watch the videos Mm -hmm. um, for our online training portal. A lot of it was for traction. Yes. When we decided to make that shift to front desk, Courtney was actually the first person that I pretty much 99.9% trained myself. Mm -hmm. I would not let our other front desk girls show her anything Mm -hmm. and bless Emily's heart, but she needed to focus on functional movement. Yes. And so I asked Courtney to come to me with everything. I came in several times just to train on front desk. Mm -hmm. She's amazing at taking notes. (laughs) And so I felt like she caught on super quick and the days that I couldn't be there in the office and there were things that I needed to show you like this morning, yes. uh, she would go watch my computer screens in the billing office when I'm remoted in. That is a see great what I'm doing. thing to oh, do. That's cool. yeah. yeah. And then I would call her on the phone because we can't necessarily do Zoom all the time. Right. So you can see my computer screens when mm-hmm. I'm remoted in and see exactly what I'm doing. So I would call her. Mm. She'd have me on speakerphone and I would walk her through the processes of everything that I'm doing. Yes. Mm. Uh, this morning we did massage tracking and she yes. picked it up. Our phone call was less than five minutes. Yes, mm. literally. And so <laughs> she picked it up and she did it herself. So Courtney is one that I trained myself mm-hmm. yes. and I feel like she truly takes ownership of the front desk. So if something is not up to her standard, <laughs> she will ask me, why do we do it this way? And I'll explain it to her. And yes. if it clicks for her, she's like, okay, got it. Awesome. Yeah. If there's something to where she's like, well, can we do it this way? Or why don't we try it this way? Then we're open to it. And I'll talk to her about things. Mm-hmm. Um, I told her the other day that don't be afraid to come to me and tell yes. me things because <laughs> if I don't know, we can't evolve and we're always evolving. So her feedback is amazing when it comes to things. So we either talk about why we do things a certain way mm-hmm. or we figure out how we can work in her ideas into what we're already doing. So yeah, that was Courtney's training process. A lot mm-hmm. of it was in person, but then a lot of it, we figured out how to do yeah. it remotely. And I yes. think it worked amazing. Cool. I think also one thing that uh, was very helpful is that the office that I was at previously used ChiroTouch. Mm. So I already, even though I wasn't front desk at the other office, I did kind of know the basics of ChiroTouch and that was helpful as well. Cool. Okay. So a couple of things that I'm hearing from this that I want to, I want to dive into or ask questions about. So one, just a, a little clarification for everyone listening to this, the, the training portal that Danny's referring to we built a membership site in ClickFunnels, just like the membership site we use for MoveNow University for doctors and their staff to get training materials and how to put their clinic together and run it, how we run it with our systems. We use that same platform, ClickFunnels. We built a membership site, which is just essentially, you take a bunch of videos, you organize them, you have a username and a password to get access to it, Mm -hmm. and then you can put them in a certain learning sequence, which is really, really helpful for internal staff training. Yeah. And so in Courtney's case, she had put her two weeks in at the other clinic, was kind of working part-time as she was phasing out, mm-hmm. had time to come into the clinic, had time to log in remotely and be able to access videos and start learning. Yes. So that's that's a phenomenal way to train your staff. I would highly, highly recommend putting together something like that because it makes the training process faster and then you don't have to have someone go through every intricate detail over and over and over again with mm-hmm. someone, but you can actually empower the staff to go and do it on their own, take yes. notes, already have a foundation, then meet with someone like Danny. If, if you have, you know, an office manager or a Danny type person in your clinic to then fine tune it based on the foundation already. Yes. Okay. So it's like working smarter, not harder type yes. thing. Thanks for checking out this clip from the move now chiropractor podcast. Be sure to join our free Facebook group, Functional Movement for Chiropractors. And if you want to see how Move Now University can help your clinical practice and your systems, be sure to check out our 30-minute pre-recorded demo at demo.movenowu.com. Thanks for hanging out with us, and we'll see you on the next one.